Hi guys, so are you ready to draw with me today? Today we are going to draw a fried egg, so let's get started! So for this one, drawing part is very very easy, it's just few lines and a half a circle and we are going to add everything through coloring. So I'm going to use color pencils for this one and if you want good quality color pencils, check the description box below for links that you can uh, check out to get your color pencils as well. So as you see with the sharpie I drew uh, like a half circle and uh, kind of like the shape of the uh, shape of a fried egg So I'm drawing few lines here and there to make it look realistic and I'll show you how it all comes together when we are coloring so if you are new to my channel, please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and hit that bell icon to get a video every single day. So we are going to go directly into coloring now. So as you see that I am going to start with the egg yolk um, and then I am going to um, go to the rest of the egg. So I am starting off with like a darker shade of yellow and then I will add some orange and yellow to the middle part here and I am not going to do a lot for the surrounding white part uh, but I am going to add some details to show that it looks like a fried egg. So you can see all that in a bit and you can follow along with me to get this uh, kind of realistic looking fried egg. You can let me know if you like it. Please don't forget to hit that like button and leave a comment for me. And if you really like this, uh, please don't forget to share my video as well. And if you have any requests for me to draw for next time, please let me know by commenting below. I will make sure to draw it for you and show you how to draw it. Also, if you want to send me your drawing to get featured in my social media and my YouTube channel uh, in my upcoming videos, don't forget to send it to me by sending it to my Facebook or my Instagram account. All the information is in the description box for you. You can connect with me um, through other media as well and I will make sure to feature your drawing in my next upcoming videos because I know you guys are so talented and I love getting your drawings as well and featuring it in my videos and showing it to everybody. So as you see here, I'm using a little bit of a, like a marker as well, only in this area. I just wanted it to look uh, like bright orange. So I used a marker, orange marker as well. You don't have to do it if you don't have one. Uh, you can just use your color pencils. Just get a bright orange color pencil. And for additional details, I'm using brown as well here. Just a light brown, just to get like a shadow uh, for the egg yolk. So you will see how it all looks at the end. Now I'm going to give you some uh, trivia and some interesting facts about fried eggs. Okay, so if you're new to these terms, I'm going to let you know a few um, details about how you can ask for your eggs in a restaurant. If you are in the United States or Canada or anywhere in North America, people will say these things and they will ask you how, you, how would you like your eggs to be done. So one of them is sunny side up. That is, the egg is fried with the yolk up and is not flipped. And the other one is over easy. Over easy egg is the egg is flipped and the yolk is still runny. So when you put it on toast, the yolk runs out to the toast, so tasty. And over medium is the egg is flipped and the yolk is only slightly runny. So, and over well is the egg is flipped and the yolk is cooked hard. 
So those are the terms that you can use to um, ask what kind of egg you like on your toast or whatever, uh, whenever they ask in a restaurant. So I hope this is interesting and you're finding it valuable. You can let me know in the comments below. You can let me know how do you like your eggs. I like over medium. I like a little runniness to the yolk because if I'm eating um, toast, I like it to be uh, runny uh, a little bit so that it soaks into the bread and it tastes so good. Um, so let me know how you like it. So as you can see now, the yolk is done and you can see that it's shining. Um, so I left a little bit of white area in the middle just to make it look like it's shining. So for the rest of it, I'm using gray, uh, black, just lightly. Uh, just to get like a shadow like effect and a tiny bit of blue like light blue um, Then uh, it will be done. So I will show you how it all looks at the end. So I hope you like it. So stay tuned So I drew a lot of food uh, drawings this week um, I hope you like them. Please let me know in the comments below and like I said before if you have any requests for me to draw for next time please let me know so I can draw that for you and let me know if you're finding these drawings easy to do and interesting um, and uh, if you have any suggestions don't forget to comment below and let me know so I can change and make it better. So you see here for the top part I didn't draw anything with the sharpie so with the color pencils I'm adding in the details. So I'm uh, using blue I added it like a slight blue line um, where the egg shape should be and underneath the egg yolk I uh, put like a little shadow and um, I'm just adding in a few more details so that it kind of pops out of the page and shows like a real egg, fried egg. So um, let me know in the comments below how you like your egg and if you like this egg. So right now I'm adding in a little bit of a shadow for the bottom part so that it stands out. And you can do the same and I'll show you how it all looks at the end. So when it comes to coloring, you can add and keep adding details even after I show you my final colored look because I didn't want to make this video too long. But if you want to make it really realistic, keep adding details and look at it from far and add more details and make sure to add it, add more and more details until you are satisfied with your drawing and uh, you think that it looks real. And also sometimes when you cook or fry eggs, you can see that some charred areas on the corners of the egg, like brown bubbly areas. So you can draw those as well uh, on the side of the egg uh, and like a crunchy crumbly pieces. Uh, to add more details if you want and um, for the lines as well for this drawing you don't have to draw it with a sharpie I just wanted to give you like an outline to start off with but uh, you can directly go um, like to coloring without even drawing it uh, just use your color pencils to color the whole thing so this is the final colored look of the fried egg that I did so you can keep add keep adding more details or you can keep it this way so if you like products like aprons and even a jigsaw puzzle or like uh, blankets and phone covers made out of this check out my red bubble link in the description box below and now I have few next videos for you to check out and don't forget to hit on my face logo to subscribe to my channel and hit that bell icon to get a video every single day because I release one for you every single day so I will see you tomorrow bye